I'd like to share with the viewers uh, a letter that Pastor Johnson received. It's a beautiful testimony from a woman named Irma Burden. Right, Pastor? Mm -hmm. Irma yeah. Burden. Mm -hmm. It says, Dear Pastor Johnson, the Lord has put it upon my heart to sit down and write this letter to let you know that you are truly an inspiration to young people. A young minister like you running this Christian race, lifting up the name of Jesus with true praise. The Spirit of the Lord is within you. I can feel the word of the Lord when you're preaching on your program. Your program, Jesus is the Answer, is truly a magnificent program. It's really done a lot for me. Every day I come home from work, I turn on the program and open up my Bible. It gives me the strength to go through everyday life. For I've learned a lot, I mean, for I have learned that without the Lord, I couldn't survive. Mm -hmm. But when I hear the Lord's word, something touches me inside and I begin to cry. I don't understand it. I know the Lord will give me the knowledge to understand this feeling, but I want you to pray for me that I grow stronger in the Lord and let him use me. The young people on your show are really filled with the Holy Spirit. They just pour out their heart to the Lord. I've never seen a group of young people praising the Lord like that. Lord, stay with them. Keep up the good work for the Lord. Yours very truly, Irma Burden. Praise the Lord. Isn't that beautiful? Mm -hmm. You know, you can write to Pastor Johnson sending cards and letters mm -hmm. to Jesus is the Answer, P.O. Box 5651, Compton, California, 90224. That's Jesus is the Answer, P.O. Box 5651, Compton, California, 90224. Right. And do right, because it lets Pastor know that his work is not going out in vain. Yeah. Because if one person is saved because of the work, mm -hmm. then he's doing what God would want him to Amen. do. So do right to him and let him know what you think. Amen. Speaking of Pastor Johnson, we're gonna share something with you you <laughs> may or may not know. You know, <clears throat> other than Jesus, I'm not real sure of anybody that hauled off after they came out of the womb and said, I am going to be an, a devout Christian, okay? If you know someone, write that in. But in any event, <laughs> Pastor Johnson and Kim and I go way back. Mm -hmm. We were all studying to be actors mm -hmm. at Al Fan Theatrical Ensemble. And uh, it brought to mind in, in letting you know, you know, all of us come from a mighty long way. Mm -hmm. And with the Lord's help, we're all able to make something out of ourselves. Mm -hmm. Not w in the worldly sense, because what, does it, what doth it profit a man mm -hmm. to gain the world and lose his soul? Mm -hmm. And so I am so delighted to know that you are in the ministry mm -hmm. because when you came to yourself, excuse me, <clears throat> when you came to yourself, as was said in Luke 15, 17, that the prodigal son came to himself, mm -hmm. it was a blessing to know that the Lord reached in, mm -hmm. touched you in he such a way you. that you left. Mm -hmm. I mean, mm -hmm. you totally left show business. Mm -hmm. That is a blessing mm -hmm. because Satan is all up in this, mm -hmm. okay? And it is real hard. Mm -hmm. And the temptations, the money, if you, if you don't want to do something important with your life, mm -hmm. then what was it all for? Mm -hmm. Why are we celebrating Christmas? Mm -hmm. Why are we caring about Jesus? Mm -hmm. But you know what, what, what <coughs> really, when I found out that Pastor Ernest became a pastor, was that not only, he, he left show business and you know, came into the Word and became an excellent preacher, mm -hmm. just lets the Lord use him mm -hmm. in all sorts of ways. But the desire that he had for worldly show business mm -hmm he put into the ministry mm -hmm. yes. and comes out with a television show. That just, I just was blown over mm -hmm. with that one. <laughs> that's, I think that's one of the reasons I like her a little bit. Mm -hmm. now, because Kim, no, Kim um, I love Kim. Kim is finding that her gift and her talents did not mean that she had to put them aside, mm -hmm. that there is a way to incorporate it. Yeah. Mm -hmm.